In this video, I will explain you about dynamic parameters in Tableau, the new feature introduced in 2020.1 version. Let us see how parameter edit dialog box looks like before dynamic parameters introduced. In 2020.1 version, we have two new options. One is value when workbook opens and the other one is when workbook opens. So, what you can do with this? One, you can update the current value of the parameter dynamically. And two, you can update the list of values dynamically. Let's see with an example how it actually works. Create some sample data to load into Tableau. Here I have the date values of this month till yesterday. Let me load the Excel data into Tableau. Before we look into the dynamic parameters, uh, let me just create a calculated field to get the latest date from the data source. So I am using the LOD calculation to get the latest date. So if we see the exact date here, the latest date available is 18 July 2020 which is the latest date in the Excel. So we will create two parameters. First one is uh, the normal parameter without using uh, dynamic functionality. So choose the date and choose list and add from the field. and leave all others as it is and create another calculated field name it as dynamic parameters choose the type as date and list now select the second option when uh, workbook opens and choose date so here at the val value when opens uh, we have written a calculated field to get the maximum date and select that maximum date. So now click OK. So let me use this uh, parameters in a calculated field so that I can display. So now I am taking the normal uh, parameter. So create another calculated field uh, and add dynamic parameter. So drag and drop uh, on the rows. So let me change the current value of the normal parameter. So before that I will increase uh, the size. Yeah, I have changed it to 18th. Uh, let me save the workbook. Uh, 
and close. So let me add a new date here, current date today. So 19-7-2020. And let me reopen the uh, before that uh, save the Excel file and uh, reopen the workbook. Normal parameter value is still the same, whereas dynamic parameter has updated the current value to the latest date. So, with this feature, we no longer need to update parameter manually.